Jakey, we finally made it. Can you believe it? It feels so surreal to me that today is finally the day we become husband and wife. I'm so thankful that God brought me to you. When I met you, I knew I stumbled upon the very thing that was going to change my life forever. I fell in love with you so deeply and so suddenly that I didn't even notice it happened until I realized it. I didn't want to spend another day not by your side. Dear Frankie, wow, today is finally the day, the day that I get to marry my best friend and the most beautiful person in the entire world. I'm picturing your stunning white dress that I've been trying so desperately to imagine, but I know it will not even compare to when I see it in person. I'm picturing that beautiful smile that lights up my world, your blonde hair and those deep brown eyes walking towards me and towards our forever together. I'm getting goosebumps just thinking about it. <laughs> oh my god, you look beautiful. Oh my god, I'm sobbing. <laughs> Oh my god, you look beautiful. Thank you. Oh my god, you look so pretty. <laughs> oh my god, you look beautiful. Look how handsome you look. It's weird being the younger sibling and um, growing up, but then also seeing your older sibling move on to the next stages of life that you're not at just yet. No longer being just one room away or being there for you to ask if you could have help on a paper just so that she'll write the whole thing for you anyway. But moving onwards is just a part of life and I couldn't be more proud of where you are today. Um, you found your person in Jake, you have a home, you even started a family of your own. And uh, who knows, maybe one day I'll get a job too, but uh, don't hold your breath Frank, still uh, living out the summer a little bit. Jake, you've played a lot of roles in my life, including my best friend, my workout partner, my advice giver, my support system, and even my voice of reason, among many others. The impact that you've had on my life is instrumental. I'm not sure I'll ever be able to put into words just how much you mean to me, and I hope you know how special you are. And like Nick said, Frankie, I hope you love growing old with him as much as I've loved growing up with him. Well, welcome everyone to the chapel at Avon Old Farm School. Uh, my name is Father Michael and I'm very honored today to be able to be a witness to this wedding. It is the promise that Frankie and Jake will make to each other today in their vows, which imparts the gift of grace from God on them. And so we join here together as one family united in the belief and hope that their love for each other will only seek the excellence of each. Frankie, you received this ring and sign of my love and fidelity. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Jake, take this ring as a sign of my love and fidelity. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. What God has put asunder, let no one separate. You may now kiss the bride. When I first met Jake and saw the two of them together, it was apparent that they were meant to be. The two of them couldn't stop smiling at each other, and you can tell just how comfortable and happy they were together. And Jake was looking at Frankie just the way he has been looking at her all day. Now Frankie, I know I haven't known you for 10 years, but in the time we've had together and seeing how happy you've made Jake and everyone around you, it's clear to me what a passionate and kind-hearted and genuine person you are. I know you've added years to the lives of the people around you just as Jake has. I cannot wait to make more memories with you and I'm so excited to see you as a wife to the man that means the world to me. Not only are you my best friend, but you're the older sister I've always wanted. You're a shapeshifter. You're my comedian, my shoulder to cry on, and my built-in therapist. There are a lot of things in this life that I can do without, but I can safely say I can't do this life without you. I'm so glad to be here to celebrate your love and your happiness. You're the mirror to my lamp and I cannot begin to describe how happy I am. You found someone who not only puts up with your antics, but loves you for them. 
So I got to know him well through the years, and I can honestly say he's the most selfless and stand-up guy I've ever met. Um, I don't think he'd be a, become a better man until he met Frankie, and she honestly, she brings out the best in him. I'm thrilled to be standing here and uh, celebrating him and his beautiful bride. Not only are they a beautiful couple, but they're a beautiful family, and I can't wait to see the wonderful man that Grayson turns into be. Literally the only downside of this family is they're both Jets fans. Um, so please raise your glass uh, to the guy who casually saved my life and the beautiful bride, Frankie.